A very good morning everyone from Austria. Sankt Wolfgang. I wasn't sure if I should be filming another video or not because I clearly have no time to edit them but I thought you know what let's just try and see what will happen. I will try to film as much as possible because it is a beautiful place and I feel like it will be a good memory to have and hopefully I can show you some very nice views around here including lakes and mountains. We will be doing some hiking as well. So it should be quite exciting trip and hopefully you've been or will be visiting Austria one day too. Now I will ask my dad what's the plan for today. The cool plan is to go us. Plan подняться на гору Шафкер. We are going to the Shafer mountain. Железная дорога. On the railway station. We are going by the train. Train to uh, 2,000 meters. 2,000 meter train will take us to the top of the mountain. But so far we came out of the hotel. We went to one shop, then we went to the second shop, then they decided to buy water. Now they want to drink coffee. I don't think we will ever make it to the mountain, but that's the plan for now. Look at the color of this water. This is just something else. I was in this area before with my family maybe like five years ago or something but right now i am amazed like i'm seeing this for the first time it's like a computer wallpaper basically i know that maybe camera does not show the same way as the real life but i think it's pretty close in terms of the colors we have now boarded the train and we'll be going up the mountain the train is like super red and bright so it's really hard not to notice when it will go up we've made it to the top of the mountain it took about maybe half an hour i would say maybe less and the temperature here is so different it's like you can feel the cold although it is sunny we had to wear like extra jacket and the plan is now to go down the mountain so i think it's very smart when you go up just take the train you can also take a train back if you want to but we do want to do some hiking so we'll be going down and we'll still have incredible views oh god it's so hard now we're just going up because there is a cafe of course we need to check out one more cafe before we start walking <laughs> Basically, this road is not as easy as I personally thought because, as you can see, the background, it's like literally just stones and we are going down, so it's like even harder and dangerous. Plus, we can hear, I'm not joking, we can hear the sound of a bear. We heard it multiple times. At first, we thought maybe it's other animals, but it's definitely bears. So I, I don't know, it's a very questionable trip but hopefully we can make it all the way down because there is no other way. So we were walking here, like these people. How insane, but we survived. I remember We have now entered the forest part of this hike and i really hope that forest doesn't mean the home of a bear plus there are other people here so that makes me feel a bit more confident about the whole situation this is not the easiest road i would say if you're just looking for a casual walk in austrian mountains some people may think that family holidays are actually super relaxed you know by the beach sunshine all of that stuff for us it's like hiking proper way and now I realized I don't know where my family is so I sort of went in front and I'm basically alone in the forest waiting for a bear <laughs> I mean actually there are other people walking so that makes me feel a bit more comfortable I feel super fit right now and that's actually quite good because I haven't been exercising much in London so trips like this help 
first one was to Peak District, where we were climbing, <laughs> not climbing, like walking in the mountains. I almost dropped. Um, walking in the mountains in 30 degrees heat now. It's in Austria with amazing views. Yeah, I'm definitely having a chocolate cake when I'm done. <laughs> Maybe ice cream as well. Oh. It's been now three hours we are walking and at first I was laughing at my family because they took this walking sticks I would say. Now I do not laugh anymore because I actually need to use them. I'm super tired. It's still three kilometers to go and at least we are lucky with the weather I would say. And now we are in some forest again. Nothing else to report here. Are you tired, my operator? My sister is shaking her hand. But yeah, we'll see you downstairs. Downstairs? Up, like down. Down in the city. We finally made it back to the lake. It was really, really hard. We spent almost four hours, 40 minutes walking. And my legs are killing me, honestly. But the views, of course were incredible so definitely recommend it especially going downhill is always easier i find than uphill so yeah now we just walking on a very straight pavement hopefully we can make it back to sankt wolfgang soon and yeah it's almost sunset time now <laughs> A very good morning from Austria, day actually two, and I decided to show you a little bit our hotel, which is like super, super cute. We'll go downstairs, have some breakfast and also show you the view as well from our balcony because we actually can see a lake and the mountains. Now I will also show you the view from my parents' bedroom. And it's even better because they're one level um, higher up than we are. Today our plan is to go on the lake excursion, but we have our regular interview segment where I'm interviewing my mom. Say hi. <laughs> hi. Let me see. How are you today? <laughs> Ну ты же знаешь, я не умею на английском. А как у вас дела сегодня? Да, у меня. Very well. Как тебе вчера поход? How did no. you find the excursion yesterday? Нам вчера поход понравился, правда, ноги чуть не отвалились, но ничего. My mom is saying that it was super tiring, but it was incredible as well. What are you looking forward to today? Что ты сегодня ждешь? Поесть, выпить и впечатлений от красот. So my mom wants to eat drink for some reason <laughs> and also enjoy more amazing use thank you so much for our usual а segment so yeah we are going to some gin store i think that's what you meant gin gin uh, but that's Liqueur. not the main destination the main destination Schnapps. is the lake so i will take you to the lake <laughs> thank you bye bye, bye. <laughs> We have entered a shop where you can find lots of soap in a different shape. Let me show you, it's really fun. Всем привет! Как дела? So we were actually laughing, <laughs> but my dad did got this monkey. <laughs> For example, we can say hello. Hello. And it just repeats the words that you are saying. And apparently it's for my mom's cafe. It will be... And it just repeats the words that you are saying. And apparently it's for my mom's cafe. It will be... It will be repeating a customer's words, I guess. Hello. Hello. We are currently still on this um, boat, which 
which takes us from one village to another village. Our final destination is St. Gilgen, I think. Oh, and the plan there to take a funicular. I'm not sure if funicular is in English, but hopefully it is. Uh, and we will go up. Luckily, not walking today. It's um, super windy here, that's why I'm wearing my dad's um, jacket because he's feeling really warm for some reason. But yeah, as you can see, the views are like straight from the fairy tale. have arrived to another viewing point today and it's actually quite nice because we can see literally the clouds the top of the mountains and through the clouds we can see the city which we have just made it by the boat and now we'll just go up at maybe like few meters up to see the whole picture and how it looks like I think I'm quite tired that's why I'm forgetting some words but anyways Let's check out the view. We have now arrived back to Sankt Volka. It got really cold in the other place, so on the way back I was just sitting inside um, the boat. I think now we'll just have some rest. But thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you very very soon. Bye!